Hey guys, how's it going? Jeremy here. <coughs> uh, excuse me. So, I quit smoking five days ago. And originally, I was kind of iffy about doing it because uh, I switched to vaping. And I was like, oh great, am I going to like one of those hipsters, you know, wearing a sweater vest and a scarf. You know, sucking on a douche flute, but no, no. That really simply wasn't the case. Um, it was actually pretty easy, although I still had times in my mind where I'm like looking around my computer for the pack of cigarettes that I'm not freaking using. But of course, we all remember what the withdrawal symptoms from cigarettes feel like. Hello, darkness, my old friend. And honestly, this was nothing like that. The only thing I experienced um, withdrawal symptom wise was probably trouble sleeping and uh, that's about it really. Nothing really too bad. I'm just surprised I made it this long because I'm the kind of person that came and go freaking four hours without a cigarette. Alright, a little backstory. I'm the kind of guy that has an addictive personality, meaning for me it's all or nothing. Um, Love freaking caffeine, love freaking nicotine. And I don't know, I smoked about, I want to say, two and a half to three packs a day for off and on ten years. And I, the first time I tried to quit, I used Chantix. That just made me crazy, but I did successfully quit. The second time I successfully quit, I did it cold turkey. And for some reason, I couldn't bring myself to actually quit this time. So that's why I did the vaping rap. Plus I found out that the vaping actually makes it to where you don't feel withdrawal symptoms. So that's a good thing, I think. Uh, a friend of mine sold me these little heavy duty uh, little vape machine. It looks like something those weird ass guys use wherever they're blowing rings professionally. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's cheesy like that, but I, I, I like it just because it gives me a lot of smoke. Yeah, I highly recommend it.